Spirit. What's poppin'? What's up? Can your homegirl get some love? Thank you for all the new subscribers. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for being you. I will be announcing the winner to be mentored by me for a week, Monday through Friday, okay, via Zoom or via Google Chats. I will be announcing that on Monday. If you like this content that's coming out of my mouth and you knew, thank you for stopping by. My message are channeled, okay? I am a seer, I am a shaman, I am a mentor, I am a spiritual advisor, okay? What's poppin', fam? What's up? Thank you for the love, thank you for the support, and I always thank you for being you. Stay encouraged, okay? Because we are getting ready to enter into 2024, all right? So, do your family tradition. Some people do uh, black eyed peas with rice. Some people do uh, different stuff. Do what you do. I have already set with my team. I am the voice of the voiceless. Let's get into the messages. What messages do you have for them? Let's give them something to talk about. Spirit said, clear the energy. I swear I'll be trying to get away from this. All right. I want you to breathe in. Breathe out slowly. I want you to think of things as positive, things that make you happy. I want you to go to your safe place. When you go to your safe place, that is where your team is going to find you. I want you to imagine the sun shining down on you. You hear children playing in the background, and then you hear the birds singing. You saying, this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it, because you are divinely blessed. You should not be stressed at all. I want you to release your cares and burdens to Archangel Gabriel. Archangel Gabriel is the messenger. So I want you to put all your troubles, all your cares on Archangel Gabriel and all your petition because he's going to send it to the divine, the most high or whoever the God that you pray to. You are love. You are light. I am magnificent. I am unapologetic. I am free. I am happy. I am blessed. I am open to receive everything that resonates towards my highest good. I am welcoming in love because this person loves me from my crown all the way to my feet. Do not over expect me to do things that they want. This is an equal relationship. I am opening ways to communication to express myself. I am learning to put myself first. I am learning to say no. I am love. Breathe in, breathe out. All right. Now let's get into the messages, shall we? A lot of y'all are learning patience. And while y'all learning this patient, while y'all are in hermit mode, this is the time to do your auto writing. Auto writing doesn't need nothing big. You just need a journal. This journal is dedicated to auto writing. You're gonna have your own ink pen or pencil or color pencil, whatever, okay? And that is dedicated to that. That pencil, pen, only needs to be used only during auto writing. This is only been to be used in auto writing. Okay, Spirit is saying a lot of y'all are going to be sitting, okay, and learning. You're learning patience. You're going to be having things come to you, okay? Things are going to be revealed to you. A lot of y'all are going through these obstacles and challenges as we speak. 
because Mercury in retrograde ends January 1st. So a lot of y'all going through this hardship, okay? A lot of y'all going through arguments, y'all going through emotional, y'all hot mess. It's because you cannot bring that baggage into 2024. Those people is not part of your plan. Those people name is not on that ticket. If you look closely at that ticket, it only says you. Those people, even though they in your family, even though they're your children or your parents or whatever, is cut from a different cloth. That really isn't your family. You came down here because you chose that family to help heal and to help uh, break generational curses. All your karmatic things that you went through in another past life it's in that family for you to finish. Okay, so a lot of y'all are doubting yourself. But Spirit said, I released the, uh, the need to know all the answers. You're not supposed to know everything. You're not supposed to. Stop putting time on everything. Because you're fucking up the rotation. A lot of y'all are going back to temptation. Because you're going back to what is your comfortable. No. No. You didn't even give this new situation a chance, okay? Because it's hard. It has things. Baby, you picked the road. You chose that path. So you got to deal with it because you've made that bed. Now lie in it, okay? These are your challenges that you're going to. A lot of y'all are asking for the fuck with the bigger dogs. A lot of y'all are asking to be seen. A lot of y'all are asking for money. But y'all can't deal with this now. Okay, so a lot of y'all being tempted because the grass look greener, but you don't understand that grass is fake. Everything that glitters is not gold. Okay? Money changes people. All right? A lot of y'all are calling in spiritual union, but y'all doubting the relationship you're in. You're doubting it because this relationship is hard. This relationship is starting to bring out things that's triggering you. You have to go through this before you get to the one that you're supposed to be. And the ones that's already with the one you're supposed to be, y'all mirror each other. So they're gonna bring out the worst and the best. When you marry somebody, it is death do you part for the better and the for good. A lot of y'all have to understand, y'all marry people when y'all wasn't supposed to and y'all not spiritually connected. So therefore, he or she's gonna always put your fire out. Okay, because they are not able to water you and your fire at the same time and light your fire at the same time. During this time, once again, Spirit is bringing up patience because you are unwilling to, to heal and fix these karmatic lessons. You were like, damn. Okay, people keep giving me a reading, say, I'm going to meet my love. I'm going I'm to get this money. I'm going to be moving. Patience. Patience. Spirits don't give a time unless they tell you in three months or something. Normally, you don't put a time because five seconds from now does not exist. I accept everything happens in divine order. You need to get your house together before this money comes, before this next move. You still haven't got rid of stuff you don't use. If you heard me and people, if you've been picking up the energy where you got to get rid of this, you got to do this, do this, it's because where are you going, you cannot take that. A lot of y'all having heartaches and loss is because of these obstacles and challenges, okay? I'm hearing be encouraged. They saying, play, playing that song, no matter what's going on. This has to take place. This has to take place. You shedding. When you shed things, it hurts. Ego's dying, so it hurts. A lot of y'all going through grief, okay? I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. It may be it takes somebody to lose you to appreciate you. Maybe you have to lead that, that relationship for him or her to really know who you were because they're not going to be able to find you in another person. Sometimes you have to leave that job because they was you was being overworked. They didn't appreciate you. That's their loss, but your gain. Okay? So you're learning to release doubt to be patient, okay? You don't ask for patience. They will teach you that. Because when you ask for patience, baby, they can make you wait till it's on your deathbed to give it to you. You have to understand grief and suffering are your teachers. You have to go through this. What else do they need to know? A lot of y'all need to sit and ask guidance from spirit. 
for these obstacles and these challenges. They will guide you. That's what a spirit guide is for. To send you someone or you can ask them. And a lot of y'all are forgetting your animal spirit. You got to talk for your animal spirit. What else? Spirit. Rejection. A lot of y'all feeling rejected by family members, by people on your work. You always there for people. And then when you finally need somebody like an emotional support or you actually low on cast and need something, and when you call those people that you always give it, they reject you. That is God protecting you saying, cut them off. Cut them off. Okay? You need to start telling people, I don't want you for an enemy. And I don't want you a friend. I wish you the best. But you can't eat at my table. I'd rather have peace than war. If you're not for me, you're against me. So God is letting you know this rejection. This is part of your obstacle and challenges before you get to the journey to fulfillment. Okay. When you're in a tough situation and your spirit is ready to offer you guidance, ask for it. You've got to remember free will. So you have to give them permission. Okay. Substance affecting your life. You could be on TikTok too much. You could be, it's 11, 11. A lot of y'all on social media too much. And when y'all have time to watch Netflix or do stuff, you have time to journal. You have time to heal. You have time to sit with your spirits, talk to God. Meditation practice. This is what spirit is saying. Meditation calms the mind and opens communication to spirit. Daily practice is recommended to center yourself. It helps you get in line. If you don't use it, you lose it. Okay? But this substance, some, some of y'all are drinking too much you got to understand alcohol is a demon it's a spirit it brings in low vibrational genes it brings in trickster spirits and a lot of y'all it's like when you get high too much you don't know what's reality and what's an illusion because you need to understand you can get a spiritual high by not having marijuana you can uh smoke rosemary you can smoke um uh shaman smoke blend you can smoke blue lotus you can smoke lavender you can smoke a lot of stuff okay when you get in meditation all right a lot of y'all are too vulnerable okay you got to understand there's different types of empaths okay an empath and a light worker are both sensitive but a light worker knows what's theirs and what's not. Your empaths, you're a giant sponge. So you're going to have to incorporate talking to yourself in third person. Why am I feeling this way? If you, if your higher self don't talk back, then you know that's not yours. A lot of y'all need to learn to keep a secret. Stop revealing everything because everybody is not your friend. Okay? Some things is meant to take to the grave with you. Some of y'all need to learn to let go of that pride and ego you really need to release because sometimes your ego is telling you 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 want to get this and spirit is saying that's not me okay ego and spirit you're gonna have to learn the difference all right on your spiritual path a lot of y'all psychic abilities are starting to enhance during this cancer moon we just had aka cold moon you have a gift of seeing for some of y'all Sometimes it's not with the natural eye, it's with the spiritual eye. Some of y'all can hear, some of y'all can feel, some of y'all can taste, some of y'all can smell. Okay, continue to develop your uh, abilities. How? By meditating, connecting with your spirit guides and animal spirit guides, connecting to your ancestors that you don't know that resonate with your higher good that goes back 200,000 years. A lot of y'all going through emotional, physical, mental stimulus at this time because you're shedding your kudalini is rising you being prepared the new earth is here and a lot of y'all are delaying your timeline jump to the new earth it's because you keep trying to bring everybody with you you start feeling stuck okay spirit is saying you're not stuck they cannot go with you okay you're going to have to love them from a distance All right, Spirit, what else do they need to know? You have the ego. This is some people can see very good as, as an ego, triumphant over troubles and obstacles. Spirits saying that y'all can fly upon your obstacles. You can fly above your challenges. You can fly above the storm, okay? You just need to learn to listen. Anytime you doubt, that's an automatically no. 
okay? God is not the God of chaos. God is not the God of confusion. So if you're getting a feeling and you keep going back and forth and you doubting it, that's an automatic no, okay? Pay attention to your intuition. You have the barrel. You feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or goals. Basically, it's you. Once again, this goes back to how you manifest. You have to go full detail. If it's about money, don't m manifest enough to cover your bills. Manifest enough for your cup to run it over. You will always have more than enough to share, to do what you love. Okay? Karma, you will reap what you sow. Everything has a cause and effect. A lot of y'all, y'all have reaped a lot of seeds in 2023 and 2022 and 2021. Baby, you can ready to see how much you develop in 2024. And then some of y'all, y'all are, y'all reap fucked up shit. So in 2024, you're going to receive that fucked up shit. Okay. So you are what you think you are, what you put out. All right. And then we have the bird flying. News is on the way. It could be about love. It could be about that money. It could be about that job you applied for, you know, a year ago. Okay? And the person they chose over you was a failure. So they get ready to pick you. And this is this job you always wanted. All right? This is what I'm hearing. Y'all got good news coming on the way. You got approved for that Section 8. You got approved for that HUD home. You got approved for that bank loan. You got approved for that credit card that's going to help you. Okay? When you manifest money, you cannot manifest money with plastic. You got to manifest money with actual money, people. Okay? Reunion. Someone is returning. Someone is returning. Could be somebody, like I said, y'all had to part ways. I keep seeing a, a getting married for the second time. Okay, someone is returning. They have finally seen your worth. They did you wrong. This could be news on the way. They looked you over for somebody else because they thought that person was better than you, but Spirit is saying no. Some of y'all are settling. Someone has resigned themselves to accepting less. You starting to say, you know, I'd rather be by myself. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, if you're not a, for me, you're against me. You're starting to cut people off. You're starting to have that grief because you had to let people go. And some of y'all fear the unknown. Y'all have to embrace the uncertainty. You have to embrace. You are a spirit, okay? These spirits have always chose you, have always been with you, all right? What are the messages? Toxic. Some of y'all are releasing a lot of toxicity, self-destruction behavior, okay? You starting to go through this. You starting to release, okay? A lot of y'all getting ready to uh, go through a lot of uh, trauma, obstacles, and challenges because, like I said, you cutting people off, people falling off because they their name is not on your ticket. A lot of y'all having miscommunication, not seeing eye to eye, a misunderstanding. This has to be settled, okay? Once again, patience. We are learning patience at this time. We're allowing things to unfold. When you do, your enemies will push enough rope where they will hang themselves. Their enemies will reveal their self. And then unconditional love. Love yourself and others without limits, conditions, or expectation. Love them like you want to be loved. But you have to give that love to you first. All right, let's get into some numbers. A lot of y'all seeing 14, 14. Let go of those negative thoughts. This is all about letting go. Use positive affirmations to attract what you truly want or desire. And a lot of y'all saying 555. Five, five. Huge changes are coming. You are being redirected on your path. Embrace it and release things that do not serve you. It may be challenging, but you're being supported. That's what I'm saying. You have to call in your guides. All right, let's get into the tarot to finish it. What do they need to know? A lot of people going to have spirits say a lot of people is going to try to interfere what God is doing for you. They cannot interfere. Like I said, that cause has been out there. The effect is you planted those good seeds. You're about to get it. Okay. Someone, you see the animal, you see the horse, your spirit animals is coming to help you to get you out of this situation. So you need to call upon them and they will get you out of any situation. Okay, 
you're ending things are ending and this is happening quickly things are ending for you your load is getting ready to be lifted up okay you don't have to go through this alone you need to ask ask and you shall receive your help comments all right your knight in shining armor is coming but it got delayed because someone is trying to interfere because they seen your come up they seen your blessings and they're very jealous but spirit is saying no they cannot interfere was yours this was destined in the stars okay spirit says some of y'all need to um uh, rest you have done a lot of diligence you've done good things in all these years i'm picking up the last three years you have put the energy out there 2024 you're going to it's growing 2024 you're going to reap it your spirits is waiting to dig it up and hand it to you so a lot of y'all going to get that blessing that money that you're asking for A lot of y'all are watching your enemy. This is the strength card. A lot of y'all watching your enemy get their karma. You either going to see it, hear about it, or spirit is going to reveal it to you. You are strong. You walk with the Lion of Judah. Okay? Can nothing harm you at this time. You are at peace. You are learning to release. And, you're, and the devil, the demons cannot touch you because you're divinely protected. If you notice the infinity sign, like I said, blessings upon blessings is coming towards you at this time you have the sun card blessings this is the most powerful and positive card in the tarot deck all right you are getting love you are getting everything you're at peace you're stepping into your power you stepping in if you want pregnancy it's going to happen blessings birth of a new job birth of a new you things are happening for you at this time just be patient and learn to release what's not yours i send you peace love and light i shall